Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Joe, and today we're gonna play some Banished. This is, um, you know, it's not a new game, but it's an indie game. It was on Steam um, a few months ago. It was released, but uh, I'm just picking it up now. It looks like an awesome game. I kind of followed this through development. I'm pretty sure this game was made by one guy, so that's pretty friggin' crazy. It's kind of like Sim City, but a cross between that and medieval times. It's it's pretty awesome. I played a little bit, probably have an hour just to figure things out. I went through the tutorial, so I don't look like a complete asshole and uh, hopefully hopefully we'll do good so let's make a new map here we'll call this um, Springton since well that seems to be the fucking name we use for everything um, a map seed I have no idea what this is so I'm sure that's a great seed we will use valleys or we can do mountains ain't no valleys high oh no that's the mountain side um, okay terrain size we'll go with medium climate will be fair uh, disasters, we want that on. That sounds like a good time. And we'll go with medium because, I don't know, I don't want to get my ass kicked. It's pretty awesome. So you pretty much have to survive the winter. That's the whole main, the main idea of the game is just um, thriving, growing your town to survive the winter. So supposedly you start with a group of settlers that, um, you know, left their old village and they, they want to start off on their own. So they travel to new land and they're going to mark their claims and, and take over the world. I have no idea what they're going to do. But anyway, we're stuck with these people. Uh, most of them are probably inbred. And um, yeah, so that's that's that. So here is um, a nice little seed. I think I started here before, actually. No, I didn't. I have no idea where we're at. Okay, so this looks like a cool spot. We got lots of water, um, some trees, and a mountain. So that's pretty cool. Okay, so let's let's pause the game here and get ourselves situated a little bit. Uh, okay, so we'll put up here, and uh, what's this, an event log, we'll put that down there, compass, we don't need that, uh, occupations, we'll need that, alright, so these are kind of the basic windows you're going to use, this one right up here shows you your current supplies we have in our supply shed, um, you know, event log is pretty self-explanatory, and uh, these are all the professions we can choose, so right now we have 10 people, and they are all signed as laborers, so yeah that's a thing so first things first um, we do have a few logs we're gonna want to build a house for these people or some homes I guess um, so let's just I am freezing for some reason so let's place this one here we'll put another one I think we need five to start with um, so that's three that's four and we will spin this around here and there's five all right, so we got some some houses um, gonna be built. Um, I don't really. I guess we need some food. We're gonna need some food, so I think maybe we should build a gatherer. I'm not sure if we should build a gatherer or a. Actually, you know what? What's the? It's early spring, so let's get let's get a farm on the go first. I don't know. I never did this before, um, so well, I never did this route before, so. Um, let's build, you know, let's get a, a field going here, and we will plant, what do we want in there? We only have peppers, so we'll plant peppers. Okay, so we're going to need one farmer for that, and um, we're probably going to need, anyway, let's just get them started on, no, we're going to need some trees. Okay, so let's cut some trees down too. Fuck, I'm really efficient today. So let's clear out that, and let's start these guys and see what happens. We'll go up to uh, five times speed. So all these people over their heads are saying we need a house, so that's what we're doing. So the main things to start off with, what you need is is housing, uh, you need to keep them warm, and you need to give them food. So we're going to tackle the housing thing, the farm, you know, that's going to be a little bit of food, so that's going to help. And the warmth thing, well, it's early spring, so we don't have to totally worry about that right yet. Um, but the, the year doesn't last very long. you got about 10 minutes to get shit on the go. And, uh, and you're getting into trouble. So these little guys are, are putting everything into our stockpiles and they're rushing around uh, building these houses. Um, we should also build, I suppose we should build um, a fishing dock here while we're, while we're here. Um, let's see, where can we build this? Letting me build this anywhere. Right there. Okay. So we'll get that built. Um, we 
They have one farmer, but I don't know if they're actually planting anything yet. Maybe we missed... I think we may have missed the season. Nope! Okay, they're farming away, so that's pretty good. And our fishing dock is being built. So once that's complete, they'll um, start uh, getting gathering some fish. It says, and uh, right down here it says, uh, the reserve of stone is low. So we will go in here and we might as well just harvest all this shit here. So we'll just get all that stone and, and trees. We must need. I don't know what this, these people are waiting for, but. Anyway, um, now that we got that, we will have, do we have a fisherman yet? I have a major lag. Okay, alright, so, is this, what are, what are these people waiting for? Maybe we don't have any, oh, we don't have any builders, that's why. <laughs> I'm stupid. Okay, so now that we have some builders, we're actually going to build our houses. That'd be pretty cool. Um... So it's late spring, I don't know, we should probably build, um, let's build a, what is this, a woodcutter, uh, yeah, okay, so we want to build this, so let's, let's put this right here, there, our houses are going up now, so they'll move in and, um, inhabit the houses and, and populate the area, um, they will stay, stay living together, but, um, you think once once the, you have enough houses for the people, you don't have to build any more houses. But if you don't, they will just keep living together, and they actually won't reproduce any children if they don't have any privacy. So you got to try to keep on top of it and keep building extra houses so they'll move in together and, and repopulate. If you want your population to grow, I guess. If not, you can just just die. I, I suppose you could just die. Hmm. Okay, so the reserve of firewood is low. I know we are working on it. I need some... Okay, so our houses are done. These people are cold. God, they're whiny. Let's, uh, let's cut down some more trees. Move this here. And now our farm is going good, so that'll add, add to our food. We have 179, but that goes down really quickly. Um, our our uh, dock is done, so let's hire a fisherman. Ah, uh, let's actually hire three of those. So we want three fishermen going. You want a big stockpile of fish. But overall, this game is beautiful. Like, I can't believe one person built this. I'm sure he helped, but I don't know. This this is awesome. Like, it looks amazing. And it's cool because it's Sim City, but like medieval, like weird style. I don't know. I like it. It's kind of cool. Uh, let's hire a woodcutter. So now they'll take the logs we get from the forest, chop it up to, into usable firewood, and all these people will quit bitching and they will be nice and warm. So now that that's done, we got some, some food there, some fish here. Uh, let's see, what else can we make? What's this saying? The firewood is low, I know. Okay, you're going to keep working there. But let's put... A nice abundance of trees here, but I'm sure I like. Oh, there's lots of trees over here, so that's pretty cool. Um, let's let's actually. Okay, so we'll build. I'm getting way ahead of myself. I am all over the place today. I have no idea why. I just had six cups of coffee, so I'm a little wired. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. Reuse resource production. That's what we want. So we are gonna make a. We need a gatherer. Where is a gatherer? Uh, orchard, pasture, gatherer's hut. Okay, so let's build this right here. And while we do that, we might as well build a hunter's lodge right there. So now we got a hunter's and gatherer's kind of little situation going on there. So hopefully that'll add to our food. I really want a good abundance of food once we get to winter. And it's late summer already, so fall is coming up. Um, we're going to need a lot of firewood, so 
I like this area over here. Like this is a butt ton of trees, which could really help us until we get our foresters hut in 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 the go. So that makes no. I can't use my words today. But anyway, so let's go. Where? Where is it? Uh, bridges. Okay. Wooden bridge. We want. That's what we want. We want a wooden bridge. So let's build that right across here. Boom. Done. So now we should have a bridge over to our abundance of trees and stone. And we'll clear that out and get some some firewood on the go. Okay, sorry about that. Alright, so this bridge is going to be built and then we will have a nice abundance of firewood. Hopefully we can clear all this and uh, I don't know, make it through the winter. That's all I really want to do. A child named Balance, or Ballas, was born, and Carmen was born. So our population is growing. Um, you can click on the houses here and see. So we got uh, these people, 22, 14, and you'll notice, like, they are very young. But I guess that's the way it was back in the day. Like, these people are living together, and they are procreating children, and they are at the age of 10 and 11. So this one is 12, and she's a laborer, and, and, uh... Fisherman at 10 like these people are crazy, but I guess that's how it was back in the day You know you got to grow the population you got to work So uh, yeah It's pretty cool And you can see right now we got our health is is actually less than our happiness But that's okay. I guess the key to a healthy life is a happy life. So I don't know It's all right so We're gonna increase this a little bit here. So they they make some more firewood and uh, we'll also build some roads while we're while we're down here and this will make them walk a little faster or help them walk a little faster mm -hmm. I guess and we'll build a road yeah that's a weird road though. I don't know why our bridge is not being built. Reserve of food is low. That's not good. And logs and stone is low. Maybe that's why. Okay, so let's clear cut. <laughs> Forestry happy. Yay. Let's um, clear cut all of this. And uh, oh fuck, winner's on the way. I guess I guess we have no choice but to do good. Our food is low and our logs is low, which is bad because we need firewood. So hopefully everyone's coming here to cut all these trees. That would be very nice. And we are gonna hire another fisherman, so we have the max for reserve of logs is low. I know they're coming. I promise. Reserve of food is low. Oh, uh, well, oh, we have a gatherer's hut here, so let's, let's hire a gatherer. There we go, so we'll have somebody scavenging the forest floor for some berries and roots and rocks and dirt and anything you can really pass up as food. Well, that'll be pretty cool. And hopefully once our hunter's shack is built, we'll be able to get some deer. Or Venice, I guess. Venison, Venice, Venice. Venice. I don't know. Okay. I know, it's very pretty. It's all snowy and cozy, but these guys are probably freezing. They don't look like they have very good clothing. Well, they don't because we haven't really made them nice clothing. Okay, so let's uh, extend this road out a wee bit. And let's build another house. Let's build another... T um, no, I'll just build one for now, I think. Logs is low again. Okay, I know. We're cutting we're cutting down as much as we can. Let's uh, clear cut all that. I don't know if that was already selected, but hopefully it was. Our food is holding out, but our logs is very low, our stone is low, and our iron is not moved, but that's because we don't have a blacksmith yet. So that should be the next thing we build actually. Um let's do that. Let's plan that that right now. Um, what do we need? Okay, so resource production. We need a blacksmith. Put that right there. I think that was a fucking. Uh, yeah, it was blacksmith. Okay. 
So we're going to need some stone for that. Oh, and our bridge, is, our bridge is starting to take shape. Look at all the stone we can get once we get this bridge. We just need a little stone to make it there. Um, let's let's uh, clear cut all this. We really need a forester shack here. I think we'll put one up here somewhere or perhaps over here. Yeah, we'll probably put one in here. That way, um, and what they do is they kind of cut and plant trees. It's, it's more of a sustainable way to get wood. Um, they just manage your forest for you, which is very handy and very good. Um, so we'll plant one over here somewhere, so that way we're not clear-cutting areas and just destroying our wood supply, which is not, well, is not very good. Logs is low again. Late winter, so it looks like we may pull through. We may just make it through another winter, which would be very good. I guess it would be our first winter. Food is low again. Okay, let's um, let's plant another field, just a small one. No, I don't want one. So our fishermen are just going like crazy. Let's see what they did last year. Um, the uh, where is that? No. Nope. Um, oh, well, that's cool. You can like follow the fishermen. Okay, I'm sorry. I just just stop. Okay. Um, I don't know how I see. Okay, there we go. So fish current season we caught 75. Previous season we caught 807. So that's not too bad. Let's go check on our. Oh, this is good, so we can hire a hunter now. So we have a, a gatherer and a hunter on the go. Previous season, we got quite a few. We started late. I forgot to hire a, a gatherer, so we are already pretty much past that. So that's pretty good. Let's see how these guys are doing. We didn't catch anything yet, but that's because I just hired them. All right, so we have a bridge. So let's, let's build our road over that bridge to speed up travel a wee bit. I really like the road system. I don't. Maybe I can't. Can I build it? Oh, maybe I can't place a dirt road. Hmm. Okay, so let's a uh, let's build um, a forester's lodge now. Let's build this right, right here. Boom. So that'll be good. But now, while we did that, let's um, let's clear cut some of this anyway. I really, I don't want to have a problem with logs. I think that's a lot. I just think I sent a lot of people. We only have one laborer, so I'm really hoping some people grow up very shortly because we need some more workers. Oh, there we go. As I said that, Kenda has become an adult is now working as a laborer. I'm curious to see how, how old Kenda is. So let's find Kenda. Kenda is probably like six. Oh, th like this house is full, so we need to build some more houses. Ken is 10. She's now adult. And she's an adult, apparently. Um, okay, so let's build another house right across the street from these boys. What's going on, neighbor? There, we'll build two houses. We should have lo plenty of logs on the on the way soon. All these logs should be cut very shortly. Our firewood, we'll just, we'll leave that for now. We're not going to use a lot of firewood early summer. Um, so we'll use our logs to build things like that we need. Like, my roads are very messy. Things we need, like houses and, and a friggin' butcher, or a butcher, um, blacksmith. So we're just waiting on logs for this and stone, which is all going to be coming from over here once people eventually make it over there. But we only have two laborers. Uh, we can't really, we can't really sacrifice any more people. So I think I'm going to speed it up to ten times here. This will hopefully get things on the go a little bit. Look at them 
go. Come on, where what are you doing? Where why are you guys not coming over here and cutting all this wood? Oh, that's a person. Where are you going? I think you were cutting wood. Look at our logs, we only have three of them. Oh, somebody grew up and is now a laborer, that's good. So we have a few more runners, because we need we need lots of people to cut down these this wood and get the stone. And our butchers, oh, right on, our blacksmith is, is close to being finished. So we need blacksmiths to make tools because, uh, you know, we're getting low on tools. And if you run out of tools, then people can't work and we're just shit out of luck. So we'll hire a blacksmith, taking away one of our laborers, unfortunately. But it is what it is. Slow this down a bit. And let's build, I don't know why that was bothering me, but it was. So our, our reserve of stone is low. There's a lot of stone here, so we'll probably steal all that. But then we're going to have to make a mine. But it looks like this is a nice spot for a mine because you have to build it into the side of a mountain. And, well, there's one right beside us, so that's pretty cool. Got the hiccups. All right, so our blacksmith is, is hopefully making some tools. Yeah, she made six tools already, so that's pretty cool. But we are going to get low on iron because, well, they're using the iron for tools. Check out our gatherers. Yeah, look at, look at that. We're already getting a lot of a lot of onions and berries and, and all that good stuff. So um, let's see. We've got venison. we got 200 of that and six leather. So we can use the leather to make some warmer clothing, and the town folk will be able to stay outside longer in the winter. Because when they get cold, they return to their homes to get warm again. But if we make some, some nice clothes, they'll be able to stay out longer. Alright, so we got a nice little town on the start right now. We got um, a path over into yonder, which is going to give us a lot of resources, which is good. And we can expand our city, but really the map is huge. Like, this is just medium and, and it's massive. Like, you could... I don't, you could build forever over here, I don't get it. It's awesome. Like, look how big this is, and I'm not even... And this is the size of what we built so far. If I could even find it again. Yeah, like, look at that, that's what we built so far. <laughs> you got a lot of room to grow. So I think next episode what we're going to do is um, perhaps build a few, well, we're always going to be building more houses. We're going to build some, a place for people to get some herbs when they're sick to keep our population healthy because you can see right now they're kind of getting a little bit sick so that's not very good and we're just going to continue on growing and hopefully I don't know hopefully survive we made it past the first winter we're into our second now so it's all good but I'm sure it's only going to get harder there's diseases you can get and there's disasters and all that good stuff so I'm looking forward to it and don't forget to like comment and subscribe guys if you want to see more from this series or you like it let me know in the comment section. That's how I know if you guys want to see more videos. So type away at something, whether it be nice or, or not very nice. Either way, I'll read it anyway. So thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you next time.